Hey guys, it's me, Kevin is Best YT here, and welcome back to part 4 of uh, Obsessed Love Adventure Utro's Diary. Like I said in the last video, we're gonna continue on, and basically, okay, okay, so in the last video, I made a big mistake. So, I said something on the, along the line of coming to play Akari's route after I'm done doing the Utsuro's happy ending. And yeah, basically, that's gonna do it for this video. And basically, basically, okay, basically, there's one more ending to get. There's actually day four. We done these two endings right here. Those two, those are done. We haven't done four yet. Okay, guys? And then there's Utsuro's happy ending, which, which we're gonna do later on, maybe in the next video, but yeah, we're gonna do day four. So this is the option when we broke up with Utsuro. Yeah, no, no, this is the, when we said, I don't like you anymore. So once we chose that option, it led down to day four, which is basically the same thing, except with a different person. So I'm looking hyped up for this. Uh, so my bad. The classroom is crowded with people in the morning as another depressing Monday came about and I was looking out the window with a blue mood. Morning! A cheerful voice jumps at me, leaning against the desk. Fuh! Seeing, seeing my big yawn... Uh, seeing, seeing my big yawn, she, pu she puffed her pout. Wow, I like the voice. I like it. I, I know I said this a bunch of times, but Utro's voice is way better than her. Who who do you think voices? Who who do you think? Which voice do you like? Do you like Utro's or whoever that girl is? Oh, Hatsuro kun were you playing games all night, right? Her name is Akari. Oh, okay, so it's Utro and Akari. Ooh. I think I like Utsuro's voice better than Akari. She's my girl. Hot Herkun better not make the, ma the same mistake like last time. Her name is Akari. She's my girlfriend. We've been dating for three months. I was the, I was the one that confessed to her and she said okay. <laughs> Come on now. Don't blame me if you fall asleep during class. There's no particular reason why I chose Akari. If I had to give a reason, then it's because I wanted a girl again. It's the same thing as last time. Hunter Hakun, I'm gonna beat the crap out of you right now, bro. What the? Oh my god. It's the same as last time. It is the exact. Why well, I'm getting Doki Doki Literature Club vibes. I don't know why, but I'm getting like a fourth wall breaker vibes for some reason. I wanted someone to heal my broken heart. That's all. Oh. This is... Okay, so that's different. This is actually different. Okay, never mind, Hotter Queen. I changed my mind. You're okay. You're not... I'm not gonna beat you up. Well, maybe later on in the game, but like, not right now. Of course, this is a secret from her. It's something that I shouldn't tell her. Just thinking about it... Just thinking about how she'll react if she finds out, that gives me this gives me the shivers. Oh. Okay, here's the question. What is today? I'm gonna go with... I don't know. Hey, did you forget? Today's our three-month anniversary. I've changed since dating Akari. I think the empty and no-confidence spirit that I was feeling had changed. Akari's bright and cheerful personality brightens up your empty, dark mood. It's like a flower bo bud blooming in the sun. It's already been three months. Oh, it's already been three months. I was really surprised that day. I never knew that Hatorakun would confess to me. There is magic in love. It transforms a plain guy looking. It transforms a plain guy like me. Oh yeah. Today I brought something good. Here, look, a cute notebook. I brought it as a fashion shop. At oh, I brought it at a fa fashion shop in front of the station. Diary exchange. It's popular these days, don't you know? Everyone's doing it. Diary exchange. 
That reminds me that I do see couples in class exchanging cute look looking notebooks. I didn't know that I didn't know that was it. I didn't know what that what was that it was for. What the hell? I can't speak English. Bro, what the hell? Well, let me drink some water real quick. This is a little bit of SMR of me drinking water, so you guys better enjoy. You know? Alright. Uh, much better. I thought it was necessary necessary for us to get to know each other more. So I thought I would start. By all means. Really? Yay! Thank you, Hatura kun. She was smiling from the heart as she handed me the cute notebook. However, those happy days didn't last long. One day, Akari suddenly stopped coming to school. Of course, as her boyfriend, I didn't know anything. I didn't know anything. Why did she stop coming to school? Maybe she had a reason that she couldn't tell me. Family reasons? Or maybe she stopped liking me. <gasps> I couldn't think of any other reason. Without knowing why, time passed. One day, suddenly, I noticed something strange in the class. There was a cute notebook inside my desk. I wonder whose is it? This notebook wasn't in here before. I'm sure that this isn't mine. But why does it look familiar? Maybe I... Maybe I opened it. Until now, the love between Akari and I was, was recorded in this. The latest page had her apology written in it. <gasps> Yo. What? No way. Yo. Akari? Maybe it's family issues? There isn't there is a reason she can't tell me. There is a reason that she can't Bro, I am sweating as hell. That gave me chills. No, I'm legit sweating my my nachas off right now like stop the cap i'm not lying who um there is a reason that she can't come to school but thinking about me i'll write a reply and leave it here for for her it's not like we have broken up we're still connected even though we're apart when i think about it my cold heart is warmed up it's okay if i believe then i'll see her again I put I put the important notebook in my bag so no one could see it. Could see. I write a reply and put it back on Akari's desk that I know that no one will sit at. Then the next day, the notebook is back at my desk. I look at the desk. I look. Ugh. I look at the latest pages and see a reply in a cute handwriting. As I see it, I get very excited. Akari and I are still connected, even though I can't see her. We are still connected. As I see the cute handwriting. I, I can feel the rope. This this continued for a month. So she didn't show up for school for like a month? That's kind of sus. Oh, wait, what if? <gasps> what if? Wait a minute. What if it's Utero behind? <gasps> what if Utero killed a car? Oh my god. How much you want, bet? Bet. Comment down below. Right now, don't cheat. Don't skip forward to the end of the video. But, okay, I'm going to guess this. What if Utero killed Akari? And then she ends up killing us, maybe, okay? I'm not sure, but I'm just guessing, okay? I did not reach the ending yet. So calm calm down, okay? After school, I waited in the empty classroom for Akari to come and get the notebook. Even though the diary exchange can continues, we can't see each other face to face. I can't even feel her warm touch. My loneliness is at the limit. I want I want one glance. I don't care if it's just one. I want to see her again with my own eyes. Why is it not possible? Why can't I see her? Akari, please tell me. I waited in the classroom until sun went down. I waited for her just just in case she came. I continued to wait. A silent classroom with the luminous sunset. I took... Okay. I took a bill. Oh my god, I actually need to skip that. This diary is almost full. I knew that there were only a few pages left. If I could see her again today... I want to buy a new notebook together. As I flipped through the pages and looked over, looked over, look. As I, 
As I flipped through the pages and looked over the page, a strange feeling of discomfort had hit me. This... I've seen this type of inter interaction somewhere before. <gasps> it's Utsuro. It's Yo, I'm getting angry. My wife is dead. <laughs> I'm looking kinda happy but at the same time kinda scared. You wrote a reply. Thank you. A familiar voice jumps in behind of me. That's not Akari's voice. It's the voice of the girl I broke up a long time ago. Yo, what the hell? <sighs> Damn! You finally realized, Hatoru-kun? See? How does she swap body? Huh? Hey! I've been thinking forever and ever and ever and How can I get you back, Hatoru-kun? How can... How you can love me again? How can I make your love only for me? The answer was simple. I just needed to get rid of the people who were in my way. Oh. Now you're all mine, Hatoru-kun. All mine. <laughs> yes. There it is. I love that laugh. The yandere laugh. The <laughs> psycho laugh. Ustro gave a crazy laugh in the classroom. I I had been deceived all this time. Until today, the person that I thought I was doing a diary exchange with turned out to be the completely different person. How can I not notice something something like this? I feel like everything that had been piled up on piled up until now just shattered into pieces and burning in front of my eyes. Although I was feeling sick to my stomach, I turned my back on Utro. Enough is enough. Really like this. While controlling my sickness, I walked to the exit. As I was walking out of the classroom, I was blocked. Flame. What? <gasps> Yo! Yo, she burning the whole school down! Oh my god! Yo, this is... This is how you know you're you're screwed. You know you screw up. This is never break up with Yandere. This is the result of what's gonna happen. You're gonna get burned to life. You're gonna become a chicken nugget. This is gonna become you. That's how Turkun right now, a chicken nugget, a burnt chicken nugget, and a Utsuro chicken nugget too, burnt. So yeah, you can't go anywhere, hot Turkun. The flames burning up, covering low key, man. I would just run through the flames. Fuck it. I get burned. I get burned. But just run through the flames. No kidding. I mean, of course you're gonna get burned, but like, don't you want to get out? You know, you could get like medical, you know, attention. I don't know, man. I mean, that's what I would do, dead ass. I'd be like, the, f the flames can't stop me, and I'll just run through like skadoodle skadaddle, and I come out all like a burnt chicken. Like, oh my god, the flames burning up, covering all exits. Can't escape. I love you. Please stay with me. So this was the true ending! Yo! What a twist! Well, I can't read the credits, but like... Damn! That was really good, that's... Damn! So that was the true ending, huh? Damn, I'm just gonna let the credits roll right now, but... Either way guys, that was the true ending. Damn, that was really good. You just get a drink of water. So, yep, that's the ending for this video. I really hope you guys enjoy. And that was pretty shocking. Let me know what you guys think by commenting down below. Let me know what you guys thought about the true ending. And if you guys want me to, basically, there's actually more. There's two. There's the student's edition and then the children one, you know. There's those. There's two modes but basically oh that's it but if you, i'm gonna if you want me to do that one then make sure to leave a like maybe subscribe and turn on post notifications to get notified when i upload wow damn that was a trendy oh yeah i guess this is the end of the game well, make sure to check out their youtube channel too which is going to be in the links in the description below and all their other 
to their there's also a link to their official website if you guys want to check it out but other than that i guess i'll see you the next i guess i'll see you you know next time you know all right peace